Hi everyone, it's CJ here, otherwise known as Jazzy Who 90. Yay! So, today a My Geekbox showed up, but as you can hear, it's jangly, which isn't up, so it's not a My Geek Box, it's a My Treat Box. Yay! So, I unboxed April's, and this one is. No. I unboxed March, which you probably would have seen by now, maybe. Um, this one is the April one, sort of. They did an April now. Um, so yeah. So I got another one to see what it's like. Yay! I forgot to say this again. Yeah. yeah. So, <laughs> I found I got this at the start. So yeah. So this is the My Ge Geek Vine thing. My treat box from my geek box, so yeah, last one was really good, so or last one they did was really good, so I hope this one's as good. I um, hope they're not the same stuff in them, particularly. I wouldn't mind if there was some duplicate of stuff, of course, but like, I hope there's not a whole box of um, Twinkies in this one, like there was in the other one, because I've already still got some from the other one. So yeah, but anyway, we shall see. I'm going to open it now. This took a while to get here again, thanks to the mailman. This ship, this was shipped like on, I don't know when, but they were like these boxes were due to ship out the 20th and the 21st. I think mine shipped about the 20. It shipped around the 27th. I think it was shipped around the 23rd there's no paper so right that's straight in there so um the 23rd and it arrived in jersey on the 8th um ready for delivery that is as well on the 8th to my house uh and it didn't show up till today which is thursday so i don't know what they did with it for like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, four days. I don't know what they were doing it for four days. Who knows? It's annoying. Anyway, I've got it now. That's the main thing. So let's see what's in here. It feels chock full of stuff again, which is great. Um, let's go for whatever this is. Okay, that's different from last time. So, uh, the first thing we've got is king size junior mints which sounds delicious it's like they look like um um minstrels ca ca uh, galaxy minstrels but instead of chocolate inside there's gooey mint stuff they sound really nice so creamy mints and pure chocolate that sounds lovely so that's the first thing Next we have, oh, a Hershey's, oh, Hershey's Air Delight, that, I've never seen that one before, Air Rated Real Chocolate, so I guess it's going to be like, um, Cadbury's, it's going to be like Aero or Cadbury's Whisper, something like that, so that's cool, let's see what else is. This, this long thing, oh, good lordy, oh, big hunk, it's a big hunk, I got a big hunk, <laughs> that amused me more than it should, chewy, honey, sweeted, nougat, <gasps> with whole roasted peanuts, oh, that sounds so good, me love, new. I love nougat, so that's really cool. Um, next big box thing of what is this? Mary Jane original. Oh, I like those. Those are cool. Um, are these American? Yep, made in the USA. That's cool. Okay, they're interesting. So what are these then? It doesn't say. I don't know what these are. I have never ever tried these before. I've never heard of them. 
rather is what I meant. And there's no thing to tell me what they are. Which isn't very good. Which is annoying, rather. Mm. Has dry roasted peanuts in the ingredients though, so I have no clue. But that's cool. So those look really interesting. So Mary Jane. So they're cool. They're nice. I like those. Um they look really cool. They look like a chewy sort of sweet, so yeah, like looking at the packet there, so that's cool. They look really cool. This isn't gonna stand up, is it? Oh just yet. Next. Oh another box of something. Lucky stick. Oh, these are cool. I like these. These are basically um pookie sticks or whatever they're called. Pookie? Is it pookie sticks? I can't remember, I've had them before. The Japanese um basically they're sticks dipped in chocolate, they're really nice. I love these. So lucky sticks. Biscuit stick covered in chocolate flavoured cream. But it's more like just chocolate basically. It, they're really nice. Um, so a Chinese thing, that's interesting, a Japanese, so take it, this is actually. Um, though I can't read Japanese, so... And it's just got the, where it's imported from. Oh wait, it's got a new, it's in English at the top. Ah. Ah, uh, Indonesia. Product of Indopin Indonesia. Licensed from blah 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 in Japan. So they're sort of a Japan y thing, made in um, whatever I just said there. Indonesia. Okay. Those are cool. I love these things. They're really, really nice. They're so lovely and Moorish. So that's cool. Am I still. Am I actually on camera here or am I? <laughs> right, so next, what is this? Oh, oh, right, okay. A and, A and W root beer made with real A and W root beer. Candy twists. Ooh, now these sound really nice. A great taste. It's chewy, um, like these chewy stick things. I'm not sure if you can see, but those are really nice. I love these things. So I love root beer and I love these things. So having root beer favoured um, twisty, dicey things are really nice. I like the idea of those. Those are cool. I'm looking forward to trying those. Nice. Right, next we have... Oh my god, that's a big thing of thing. Oh. Oh, interesting. Oh, okay. Um, so who makes these? Are these American? Oh, they're Hershey's. Okay. So... We have Hershey's answer to Maltesers, basically, but they call them Whoppers. Basically, I think they're exactly the same. Anyway, they are, yeah, original malted milk balls. So that's interesting to try. I'm really intrigued to try these because obviously I love Maltesers. They're the best things ever. And these are like exactly probably the same. So I'm interested to see how these ones compare to the Nestle ones. And there's a that's a really nice big bag to get of them as well. <gasps> yeah. Cool. I like those. Those are awesome. Next. What's this? Big League Chew. Oh god, bubblegum. <laughs> okay. A whole lot of gum in every pouch. I don't get this. Bubblegum, wild patch watermelon. What is it? It's, that's weird. What is it? It's bubble 
bubble gum. But it's shaped, it's like powder form. What the heck? Oh, that is weird. Okay. Intriguing. Hmm. It says it's well patched watermelon flavour, so that should be good. Okay, I have no idea. It's USA thing again. Big League Chew watermelon flavoured bubble gum, apparently. But it's like a powder? I don't know how this works. Intriguing. I will be intrigued to open that and see what that tastes like. But that's cool. That's interesting. Anyway, I'm really intrigued by that one. Right, let's see what this is. Swedish fish. Aww. A fat free food. <laughs> Soft and chewy sweet candy. Oh, they're adorable. They're little fishies. They're adorable. What flavour are they? Mm, it doesn't say. You know what? A lot of this American sweets don't actually say what the flavours of them are. So it'll be interesting to see. Um, oh, Canada. Made in Canada. That's intriguing. Those are cool. Those are funny. I love chewy sweets, so that's awesome. Like gummy sweets. So those are cool. Swedish fish. That's very intriguing. Am I still on camera here with these? No, I'm not. I need to move them back. That's better, I think. Right, next. What's this? Uno. Uno? 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 I don't know. You know? You know. You know. I take it that's said. You know. I have no idea. Rich creamy chocolate. Yeah, what is it though? Um, California. No idea. I don't know what that is. Never heard of it. So intriguing. It doesn't say much on there. It just says rich creamy chocolate so intriguing i'll be intrigued to see what that is you know do you know because i don't know <laughs> right there's a big box i hope it's not twinkies right let's see what this is milky way okay that's French, oh, that's not a milky one. That's weird. It's similar though. Rich chocolate, creamy caramel. Okay, Milky Way bar. It's not the UK like one. It's a different one. Um, USA, I take it again. Um, yeah, North America. So yeah, this is called a Milky Way French vanilla and caramel. So it says rich chocolate, it's creamy caramel and smooth nougat. So that sounds lovely. It's a bit like sounds like nougat covered chocolate. I mean chocolate covered nougat. Um, this is a lollipop. Um, Dum Dums, original pops. Save wraps for stuff. Mystery flavor. Okay, we have a mystery flavor lollipop called Dum Dums. <laughs> Never heard of them. So there you go. Uh, I think this could be the last thing in the box. So it's not as full as the last one was, but I don't mind that. What are these? Mrs. Freshly Swiss Rolls. Made of Reese's peanut butter. <gasps> Ooh. 12 cream filled cakes with butter, peanut butter filling. <gasps> they look so good. <gasps> Ooh. Okay. I love cake. Um, so these are very appealing. Swiss rolls with peanut butter in the middle instead of jam. 
That's amazing. Those are so cool. I, I really like the sounds of those. So that's cool. So there's 12 of those in there. And I think that's it. That is it. That is it. So it's not as full as the other one was. But I don't mind because you've got bigger items in it. Um, if they do one this month, I might think about getting one as well. But we shall see. Um, I like this. This is cool. Um, yeah, there's not so many little things and more big things. But I don't mind that because the, the stuff that is in there is pretty cool. These I can't wait to try. I love root beer. So I'm really, really looking forward to these. They sound so good. They sound amazing. Um, I like the Swiss rolls. And I love that we've got a big bag of these. So they've gone for bigger bags of stuff rather than smaller stuff. Um, which I don't mind. Um, these are good to try once. So um, if they do another one of these, it will be different stuff again, obviously. So... I like that they've changed it around a bit, so I don't mind. Um, these, I think, appeal to me a lot more than the Twinkies did. So, really intrigued by that. Mary Jane looks really good. The Junior Mints look really good. I love these. You can't go wrong with these. Um, the Uno is pretty cool. The Uno is a mystery to me. I don't know what's in it, but it should be good. Um... I'm really looking forward to trying my big hunk because that sounds really good. Yeah. Ha. Yeah. Really, really good. Cool. And mystery lollipop. Wonder what the flavour could be. Um, yeah. So it's all really cool stuff. Um, yeah. Um, I don't particularly mind that there was more big stuff than small stuff this month but I hope they don't do it every month if they're going to do these on a regular basis you know I hope that they don't put big stuff in every month like I don't mind stuff like this if it's something I like like the um Twinkies I tried once just to try them um but I've still got half a box left I think so yeah I don't know about that but hey it doesn't I don't particularly mind I'm looking forward to trying the weird foreign Maltesers and the root beer chews they look really good so yeah I am happy with this box it's really good um, I can't wait to see if they do another one next month anyway my camera's flashing so I've got to go thank you for watching bye